So I collected a massive 2 0 victory over Buxton, clinches our survival in, in the National League North. Must be happy with that at the end today. Over the moon, over the moon to finally get over the line. It's been a long time coming. Um, but I had every faith and confidence uh, we'd be able to get over the line. It was just a case of matter when, really. And we did it at the last game, last game of the season. Um, better late than never. But no, I'm, I'm actually, yeah, obviously over the moon. And it's been a difficult, interesting season. You know, Cup City, we had 44 points in February and then um, kind of limped over the line. So it's been a massive learning curve, um, but it's been one that I've enjoyed. I've enjoyed and. <clears throat> You know, we could have been Buxton, we have nothing to play for. Um, uh, it would have been less interesting, but no, I thought, I thought we um, definitely deserved it over, over, the, over the course of the season, I think so. Especially how, how we started as well, um, getting all them points on the board. So, yeah, it's, it's one I'll definitely remember. Yeah, you say better late than never. Do you think it's fair to say, you know, we saved one of our best performances for last this season? Yeah, I think so. I think, um, you know, last 10 games, 9, 10 games have been very difficult. You know, when you lose those many games, you, it's, it's easy for you, for you to knock your confidence and heads go down, which, which to be fair, a few a few did, to be fair. And it was just finding a way, ways to pick them up and, and keep them going. We didn't really want to get into this situation, but we did. We found ourselves here. But um, I think having a week off, uh, this week um, it gave us an opportunity to work on a few things and there have been a lot of tired legs um, so it's, it's, it's been a great opportunity for them to recover um, and like I said today we, we, ran, we kind of ran all over them to be honest I thought we ran harder um, and we looked like our normal self like we're back to our normal self we got a lot of players back from injuries and suspension today which is which you saw and obviously with, a, with, with our squad if we miss one or two we, you can definitely see it you can definitely see it so the fact that we had um, most of the players back today kind of shown, shown through the results and the performance today. So, um, yeah, it's been a case where we've not had that for the last nine, ten games, really. And it's kind of shown, really. So, it's been a perfect time to have, have the players back at the last game of the season to get us, get us over the line. Yeah, it's been a season you know, of real ups and downs at times. We've had that great start, then yeah. slumped, and then had a great mid-season. Then, obviously, it's been tough in the second half. Yeah. How proud are you of the group, you know, for coming come, for coming through all those challenges? Yeah, I said to them like after, after the game, it's it's, it's uh, football is all about learning um, and growing and developing, and this season's definitely been that case. Um, you can't win all your games. There's going to be ups and downs, like they have been this season. We had a lot of ups at the start of the season, you know, six, seven games unbeaten, and then we went on that massive run, you know, being nine, ten games unbeaten until we played uh, scum, scum for back to back, and that kind of knocked us a little bit. So it's, it's, all, it's all a learning curve um, and you've got to try and take the positives, learn from the negatives, learn from the negative, which will make, make you a better person, better player, better manager, better coach, better staff and take that into next season. It's all about building and, and doing better than previous seasons, really. Yeah, and as, as it has been an interesting season, your first season in management as well, how do you think you've grown as a manager as, as well as a person? Yeah, it's been massive. It's been a test, test, testing times at times. Um, but it's one that I've always, you know, I've relished. You know, I've always been one where backs against the wall and you've got to define the odds. Kind of been that situation this season. Um, so, you know, it's one that I'll, you know, remember. You know, first year in, 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 ma in managing, you know, head coach. It's, it's definitely one that I'll always remember and but with all memories. But at the same time, I'll take every bits of it um, and, and build, build, it, build it on for, ne for next year. I always take the rough, you have to take the rough with the smooth in football. Um, so I relish, I relish the positives and I relish the negatives because you only grow when you when you when you face negative uh, situations. So and you, you, I've definitely learned from a lot of that, which will stand me stand me good stead for the future.